What is wrong? <sighs> this is ridiculous. You want to know what it is? What is it? It's an eight ounce jig head. Eight ounce jig head? That's bad. Too heavy. Too heavy. So this time of year, whenever they're yeah. being like they are, I like something arrow like this, like this kind of jig head. It's yeah. really aerodynamic. It's uh -huh. light. So whenever those fish go up to it, they go. Just it's little. getting in their mouth. Okay. Because that heavy head, they like that bait. Yeah. I'm gonna. Just, if you I got a, if you have, a, do you have like a 32nd or a 16th? I do. If you put one of them on, I bet your hookup ratio goes up. We'll try it. It'll be a little experiment. This would be a great tip, man. A great tip. That's uh, something a bass fishing buddy of mine taught me. Let's see what you put on there. I just put on. That. 16th I think that'll help you. I think you're gonna have much better luck with that jig head. This will be the experiment. Yeah, I don't think that'll be. Okay, his head's on the left. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty, pretty big. No, oh, I have to. I'll take him. Look at you, John! Teaching me how to fish. Thank you, Grandpa Gelati. Thank I you. I got you. I got you. And look, you were right. Tip, little he, tip work. Is that, it in his mouth? That's the biggest, that's the furthest back that I've had a fish today. Yep. And it's way back in his gullet. Yep. Because that, it was lighter. It's and they can lighter feel the weight. and those fish, yeah. And they can feel the weight somewhat, but it's more oh, of. Oh, 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 oh. Do you see what's on that log? Turn to the right. Turn to the right. Get that fish. Yep. We'll do the explanation later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, guys. We'll teach you later how to fish. I don't know if you'll come off. Oh, that's a hog. That's a Ooh, hog. Ooh, it's a big one. If he gets in the boat, he's a real big one. Do ya? Look what's on that Boom. Look what's on that log. <laughs> there we go. Whew. Nice. Wow. 14 inch yeah. crappie booyakasha. You gotta, you gotta hold that. I gotta hold it? I get an assist that. on that you one. You gotta hold that one. Yeah. Look at that. Just football. We were talking about the suggestion of basically taking it lighter. You know, that's what we did. We just took it lighter. I've, I've missed three or four bites for no other reason than the weight. Yep. Isn't that right? Yep. When a crappie and just fish in general and they eat, they don't move in and bite they'll set they'll be stationary like like we're seeing on the scope yeah they'll be very stationary and then they'll just end do 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 which direction were you looking oh that was the that's the fish we just turned loose well i think oh there's a new one there's a new one but yeah they don't attack the bait they'll go up to it ambush it yeah. you know they're, they'll go at it and if it doesn't feel right they've been spitting it out just as fast as they yeah. spit it in Oh my gosh, there we go. 20. There's an open, That's open a big water one. fish. That is a big one. But yeah, I think it, it, getting that fish whenever he does that, a lighter bait will go into his gu a gullet further than an eighth ounce, yeah. quarter ounce, things of that nature. Without him feeling it, yep. so he'll take it back farther. Yep. Should I pitch on that fish? Yep. <laughs> Ooh, he's changing directions like crazy. Whoa, that's not the right one. There we go. But that's that doesn't get much better than that either. Oh yeah. Got it. That's 16 ounce head. Yeah, you know, the difference once again. I haven't had having trouble setting the hook. We go to a smaller jig head and now they're sucking it back in the gullet. Yep. And I've caught every one I've attempted on. Thank you, John! Grandpa John! <laughs> Your name's John. Gotcha. Yeah. Another one out there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that other fish. He doesn't look too bad. Not too shabby. No. Right there, I'm gonna control you a little closer to you. A little bit to your left, about a foot. There you go. Perfect. Now. 
Ooh. That one got big all of a sudden, didn't it? Yeah, that's a that's a good fish. Down just a little bit. There you go. He's moving on it. Now. Oh, it's a big one. That's a big one. I got him. That's a big one. Oh yeah. Finally got him. Nice black fish, I believe. Yep. Look at that line. I can't even hardly see it. There we go. Come on. Ah. Woohoo! That's a pretty fish. Well, look how thick he is across the back. Wow. And look how making that switch to that littler jig head got him engulfing it. Yep. So I can actually reel one in. Yeah. <laughs> it's been a frustrating day. I bet we've lost 20 fish today. Oh. Me? I have. <laughs> I've lost it. This one wasn't getting up. Oh, there's that. that there, there's another one in there. I thought that was the one you just caught. No. It's double up there. Heck, I don't think I can get this one out. I'm going to need some pliers, believe it or not, to catch that fish. Here he comes. Nice. You doubled up. Yeah, yours is a <laughs> little more. <laughs> I have been slimed here. You can get it buried? Yeah. I'm gonna need some Add pliers. Yeah, I got them right there between the consoles. I'll tell you what, all in all, this has been a good day of fishing. That's funny, just a little different angle. The jig came right out of there. All right, there's my big one for the day. Oh, and there's the biggest of the day, right there. <laughs> 